Welcome back, everybody. And for our final tutorial, we are going to finalize our manage management information database system for our electronic store. Um, now, before we go in and we finalize this to make this a final usable program for our employees to use, um, please go down to your form section and make sure that when you click on any of your forms, that they actually open up in a form view and not in a data sheet view. Okay. Uh, so once you've done that, uh, we can go to create and we will select navigation and we're going to choose vertical tabs left. And so basically what's going to happen here is our forms will show up in this area here and we're going to have our menu items down here. So because we've uh, created a database system management system for an electronic store, uh, our invoices are going to be the most common elements. So we're going to choose that as our uh, first option for our, for our employees to use. After that, we're going to want our customer information. So we'll put that under there. Uh, we'll also want our item master form for information about our products and our suppliers and our employees. Okay, so these are the, uh, these are the forms that we uh, want to select and move over here. Uh, now that we've got our usable forms, we're going to want the four reports included in our system as well that we created, our employee sales, our payroll, our gross margin report, and our product sales. So we'll move these over one at a time in the same way. Okay, so we've got everything moved over where we, look, where we want it. So let's go up here and right-click and save this. We'll save it as navigation form, right? We will close. Now, before we go any further and we finalize this, we want to save this as a backup file. So we'll file, save as. I'll just throw it on my desktop here. Backup. Okay. All right. So we've got it saved as our backup. And now we can go in and we will select options. Let me just back up for a minute. So we want to go to file. We'll select options. And what we want to do at this point is we want to select current database. And we want to give our program a title. So we'll name it our store, our business. Okay. And next here, where it says display form, we're going to select navigation form. And then there's a few things we're not going to want. Okay. So we want to disable the display navigation pane, and we want to also deselect allow full menus. We don't want uh, the employees to be able to access any menus. We'll select OK. And it says you must close and reopen the current database for this specific option to take effect. So we'll do that. And we will close it. open and we have our workable program uh, now what we can do here is we can close this ribbon to make it a little bit neater okay so over here we've got our uh, we've got our invoices our item master form for our products our supplier details our customer forms employee forms and then our reports our sales our payroll our gross margin report and our product sales Okay, and that will wrap up your uh, your project. So uh, good luck with that, and please uh, submit it in the Dropbox once you've got it completed. Thanks very much, and we will see you later.